The objective of this topic is to set the proper machine settings, read the puddle, and to manipulate the electrode properly in order to deposit fillet welds in horizontal position lap joints. A horizontal position fillet weld is one in which the weld is deposited on the upper side of a horizontal surface and against a vertical surface. Since the face of the weld is not in the horizontal plane, it does not conform to flat position standards. It is covered in the flat position series because it is similar in procedure. Lap joint practice will teach accurate control of bead size because the length of one leg is determined by the thickness of the overlapping plate. The fillet welded lap joint is one of the most common types in use today. It is used in making almost every welded structure. Stadium bleachers, equipment platforms, and fire escapes. Follow the general procedure steps. Use proper tools, protective clothing, and eye protection. The materials and power source settings for this exercise are listed in your workbook. Position the plates to form a lap joint at about the middle. Hold them firmly together and strike an arc at the end of the joint. Make short welds called tack welds on each end of the joint to hold it together and in alignment while welding. Thoroughly clean the slag. Add three additional pieces and tack weld in the same manner to form four lap joints. Angle the electrode 40 to 45 degrees from vertical and 5 to 10 degrees in the direction of travel. Strike an arc one half inch from the end of the joint. Hold a two diameter arc length and move back to the beginning of the joint, shortening the arc length to one electrode diameter. Adjust the travel speed to fill the joint completely while moving along at a smooth, even pace. When the length of the joint is completely filled, break the arc, clean off the slag, and inspect the weld. The leg dimensions should be equal. The surface ripple should be smooth, even, and free of pinholes. Turn the workpiece over and continue practice on the opposite joints. Then check with the instructor 